Hey y'all, here we have the Chapin sprayer because today I'm going to be spraying some weeds. The hose nozzle clips right into the handle, so I just unclip it. And the handle is fairly comfortable and straightforward. You just push up on that lever. And at the end of the sprayer, which I'll show you later, you can adjust how it sprays. So first, we've already put in the solution, and now you just pump up and down until it feels a little bit tight, and then you just twist and the handle will lock into place. So I have some weeds growing in my rocks here. And you can see when I spray, it's spraying onto a fairly large area. And this is great for a rocky area like this. It'll get everything there. The other thing I wanna point out is I'm relatively tall, I'm 5'11", and the distance from my hand to the end of the sprayer nozzle is 13 inches, so I'm always bending down to make sure the sprayer is hitting the exact part of the ground that I want it to hit. I've now adjusted the spray nozzle so it just has a direct stream of spray, and you can adjust it back to the wider area of spray by twisting the end of the nozzle. Here's a quick view of how the handle twists into the container and stays put. It has that little plastic piece that you just twist in there so it locks. It also has these markers on the outside of the container so you know if you only want a half gallon or a full gallon or liters, it's listed there on the outside. This has been working for me for years. I just wish the hose was longer so I don't have to bend over.